Why is beer important? Oh man, you know, it's social. Beer is relaxing. Beer is critical to society. You know, you get to see people, they're generally always happy when they're at a bar. And that's, that's what makes it fun working here. You know, we're not necessarily changing the world, but we're making it a better place. You know, we started in Battle Creek, a small brew pub kind of facility, and then once the craft industry kind of expanded, we decided that we wanted to grow, and so we came to Kalamazoo. Uh, we're right on the Kalamazoo River, right in the heart of downtown. And uh, we tooled up to be a 60,000 barrel brewery. And our bottling line, we can do about 200 bottles a minute. So generally about 1,500 cases by lunchtime. So we can move some serious beer. <laughs> With brewing, uh, temperature control is really the most important thing. You can set your ingredients up perfectly. You can do you know, your boil perfectly. But if you don't control your fermentation temperature, all of that goes out the window and it really becomes awful beer. So that is why the coolant cooler chiller is the most important part of our process. Uh, we have to keep that beer at a sustained 68 degrees or we're dumping 3,000 gallons of beer down the drain. In the brewing process, you're constantly going up and down in terms of your volumes. So instead of having individual chillers spread out throughout the facility and having to deal with the maintenance of it, and having to deal with the footprint of it, we just decided, hey, let's build a central chiller and then we can provide cooling to the entire facility. So, you know, any given day, we could be using 40% of that chiller capacity and then the next day we're only using 10%. And then also for us, you know, we need to consistently have 28 degree fluid, which, you know, that's something that takes into account a lot of custom design to get down that low. And that's what I felt like Cool and Coolers did really well was taking into account everything that we needed and not trying to put us in a certain box of, you know, this is what we have, deal with it. It was how can we achieve that solution, you know, given a certain amount of constraints. So it, it's constant communication and that's, that's what's important. You know, feeling confident that your system's gonna work today, tomorrow, and you know, 10 years down the road. <laughs>